welcome to let us do a lab activity to know the reaction of metals and nonmetals with oxygen click each tab to know more the aim of this activity is to know the reaction of metals and nonmetals with oxygen The materials used in this lab activity are 1 metal sample magnesium 1 non-metal sample sulfur Bunsen burner litmus papers blue and red Take a magnesium ribbon Hold the ribbon with a pair of tongs. Burn the ribbon using a burner. Collect the ash which is formed by burning the ribbon in a watch glass. Now dissolve the ashes in water. Take both blue and red litmus papers. Dip them in the resultant solution individually. Observe the changes in color of both the litmus papers. In this activity, we have observed that magnesium ribbon burns brilliantly and a white ash is left behind. We also have observed that the red litmus paper turns into blue color and blue litmus paper remains unchanged. Collect some sulfur powder in a watch glass. Burn the sulfur powder using a burner. Collect the fumes which are obtained by the burning sulfur in a test tube. Add a few drops of water in the test tube. Now, shake the test tube. Take both blue and red litmus papers. Dip them in the resultant solution. Observe the changes in the color of both the litmus papers. In this activity, we have observed that the blue litmus paper turns into red color and the color of red litmus paper remains unchanged. In this activity, we have learned that magnesium produces acidic oxides when dissolved in water. Sulfur produces basic oxides when dissolved in water. Finally, we learn that most metals produce basic oxides and most non-metals produce acidic oxides when dissolved in water.